Hi guys, today I'm talking about the Riot board. This is a single board microcomputer which has the Android operating system pre-installed. This is the same operating system as in several mobile phones and tablets. Some of the features of this board are four USB ports, an Ethernet port, a serial debug port, a mini USB connection, a USD card port, an expansion port, a power socket for 5 volt input, three user controlled LEDs and a power LED, another mini USB port for OpenSDA, a camera port, an LVDS, a HDMI port, microphone input, audio output, a reset switch and a Cortex A9 microprocessor. Today I'm going to show you how to create a basic application for the Riot board. You will need a USB keyboard, a USB mouse, a HDMI screen, a micro USB cable, and a 5 volt power supply. Once you have everything plugged in, you need to download the Android Development Bundle, which has Android Studio inside it rather than Eclipse. The link for this is below. Once you've downloaded the application, you need to open it on your chosen development machine. Then click File, New Project, and go through the series of menus. Select Blank Activity from the Activity menu. Enter whatever choice of um, details you, you want for the activity name, layout name, and title. This will then take a minute to compile on your um, development machine. On the new project, which should open on your chosen development environment, there will be a new basic activity. This is pre-filled with Android code, which shows you some of the basic syntax that the language has, and also a way to output text to your screen. The usual text for this is Hello World, as this is the initial program chosen by many different programmers in order to learn a new language or a new device. We can then plug in a USB connection from the laptop to the device and send the application from your computer to the microcomputer. You will now need to plug a micro USB cable from your laptop to the development board. This will then signify a pop-up on the development board's operating system asking whether you want to enable the USB debugging. Tick always allow from this computer and press OK. On your laptop, go back to the development application. In the middle of the second menu on your development environment, there should be a green triangle button. Press, press this button, which will run your application. A pop-up box saying choose device should now display. Um, select Freescale Riotboard MX6 Solo and press OK. This will then display your application on the Riotboard screen. You can take from this some basic syntax training um, and some basic output, input output of four applications on the Riotboard. You can also then go from this to creating a Gmail application which reads the unread Gmails on your email server and flashes an LED according to this. You can find out more about this in the link below.